I think I'll hit the buffet again. We both said the same thing at the exact same time. It's like we're literally meant to be. It's like we're literally meant to be. <laughs> oh, they're so cheesy. <laughs> yeah, cheesier than this fromage con queso. <laughs> oh, remember that time Bobby decided store-bought flowers were too impersonal, so he picked his own? Yeah, and they turned out to be poison ivy. Lori swelled up like a salted turkey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look, they're getting along. Does that mean? Babe, this has been torture. Oh, Bobby Boo Boo Bear. Hot frog tamales coming through. Just follow my lead and remember, regular and normal. Oops, <laughs> Boo Boo Bear, what am I doing wrong? Can you help me? But babe, you're on the varsity golf, ow! I mean, sure babe, I'll help you. Okay, just square your shoulders and follow through. Oops. Ow! What was that for? I thought, uh, um, uh, how about that baseball team that played the other night? Ooh, <laughs> great shot, Boo Boo Bear. <laughs> that one's for you, babe. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, great shot, Rocky Bear. What? I totally shanked it. My ball went down a rain gutter. Ha ha, ha ha, you're so funny. Ah! Uh, what is going on? Lori? What are you doing here? What are you doing here? I'm sorry you have to find out this way. Bobby's been cheating on you. What, what are, are you, you talking, talking about? about? I'm talking about this. Care to explain? Sure. That's my coworker Dana from the department store. She was helping me pick out the dress and earrings I bought Lori. That's Monica from my tour guide job. She was showing me the most romantic spots to take Lori to. And that's Pam from my dry cleaning job. She was fitting me for a tux. Oh, <laughs> and that's Darren. I met him on the bus. He was teaching me how to dance. And in case you were wondering, Clyde's neighbor is Terry, my coworker at the pizzeria. She taught me how to order an Italian Mandarin. Oh, wow. So I guess we were really wrong about the dog. Sorry, you guys. We got a little ahead of ourselves. Well, you did almost literally ruin our anniversary. I ought to beat every one of you. But I appreciate all of you looking out for me. So you're not mad? Ahem! <laughs> I hated to break up this love fest, but how do you intend to pay for my linguine dim sum? Hurry up with those Kung Pao anchovies! We need a new plan and fast, but what? Tune in tonight for the finale of The Dream Boat. Can Bryant keep hope afloat with his one-on-one -on -one dinghy date with Karen, or will it be man overboard? Ah, dinghy date! A one-on-one -on -one dinghy date, <laughs> sort of. Wow, just like the dreamboat. It's so romantic, babe. I know, because we're so romantic. I mean, we literally have such a great connection, don't you think? Totally, and I was gonna tell you. <laughs> I eat my mangoes! My mango guy's in trouble. I'm sorry, babe, bodega business calls. <sighs> This should do. Ugh. Where is Bobby? Boo Boo Bear! <gasps> you made it. Oh, babe! What did you do to yourself? Oh, good thing I brought scarves. Maybe we can hide the swelling, or I could just shoot you from behind. Babe, I got my wisdom teeth out, remember? I told you weeks ago. Oh my gosh, you did. Boo Boo Bear, I am so sorry. I've been so selfish. I can't believe you still drove all this way, especially after what you've been through. Oh, babe, I would drive to the moon for you. Uh, oh, Boo Boo Bear. <laughs> you know what? Forget about the dumb selfie. Let's just make the most of our time together. I can't believe I've been so obsessed with trying to beat Carol Pingree. Maybe she is better than me at everything, but who cares? I still have lots of great things in my life, like a really amazing boyfriend, for starters. Aw, Boo Boo Bear. Oh, I skipped into a 
all good. You're gonna love this next surprise. Remember our first date? Of course. You wore a tie and showed up two hours early and took me to... Aw, Jean wants French Mex Buffet. Close for health code violations. Come on! Don't worry, Boo Boo Bear. It was still a sweet idea. And besides, I made us lunch plans too. This is supposed to be the most romantic restaurant in town. You literally eat in complete darkness. Ooh, trendy. Hey, babe, I found us a free table. Oh, get off me! Sorry, sir. Poor man with a deep voice. Hang on, Boo Boo Bear. I think I found a light switch. <laughs> Turn this red off! Why don't you grab us a table while I park the van? <laughs> BRBB. Be right back. What's the extra B for? Babe. <laughs> Bobby? That's right. I don't appreciate being cut off. Yuck. From communication. Well, we didn't appreciate you spying on us. We've all helped out here and know what to do. Look around. Nothing went wrong. How can you say that? The mangoes smell like trout. The milk is facing the wrong way. This can is off by a centimeter. You're being so picky. That stuff doesn't matter. It matters to me. I don't need a bunch of kids coming in here and changing everything. You'll understand when you're older. Oh, I think we understand now. You just like them at a collar run in a very specific way. So run it yourself. Yeah, we are quick. Later, Hefe. Now what? I can't close the mercado. Par's gonna need his post-workout protein bar soon. And Mr. Chang's gonna need his coffee for his night shift. Plus, Lori's waiting on me. Oh no, Lori. <laughs> Maybell, I'll be right back. Take your time. Sorry it took so long, babe. Anyway, I was thinking we could get half cheese and half pepperoni. No! Cashews cost a fortune! I said cheese. Oh, great, yeah. Let's let's just get that then. <laughs> What's this? One dinky flower? My babe deserves a bouquet. BRBB -B -B with a B. The last B is for bouquet. Oh, Boo Boo Bear, this is so romantic. And these pizza tacos your abuela made are delicious. Thanks, babe. I'm just glad we're finally celebrating our pizzaversary the way you deserve. Thanks, Boo Boo Bear. Literally, best pizzaversary ever. Uh oh. Maybe Tia Frida shouldn't have used real pepperonis. Stop! No! Go! Ah! <laughs> oh, 